Hey everyone, Ash here, and if you're like me, you find the new Star Wars canon to be lackluster and unfulfilling. Journey with me to a galaxy far, far away as we look back at the expanded universe, which filled our imaginations and kept the Star Wars franchise alive for decades before the likes of Rey and Kylo Ren debuted on the big screen. Journey with me into the Legends of Star Wars. The Outbound Flight Project was an exploratory mission into the unknown regions of space, conceived by Jedi Master Joris Subioth. Launched approximately 27 years before the Battle of Yavin, the Outbound Flight Project was meant to catalog new life forms discovered in the unknown regions, as well as seek out any other species of Force user to potentially grow the Jedi Order's knowledge of the Force. Joining Master Subioth for this mission were six Jedi Masters, a dozen or so Jedi Knights, and some 50,000 other crew and family members. Among the Jedi aboard were Subeo's own former Padawan, Lorena Jinsler, as well as Obi-Wan Kenobi and his apprentice, Anakin Skywalker. Having approved the mission as Supreme Chancellor Palpatine, Darth Sidious could not pass this opportunity to rid the galaxy of so many Jedi, and began plotting for outbound flight never to return from unknown space, ordering his aide, Kinman Doriana, to mount a small force and wait to ambush outbound flight once it left Republic space. However, Doriana met the Chiss defense fleet first, led by Commander Mithra Nuruodu, who destroyed Doriana's entire fleet, save for his own flagship. Meanwhile, Palpatine, having learned of Kenobi and Skywalker's presence aboard outbound flight, ordered their immediate removal from the ship before it left Republic space. Upon entering the unknown regions, the exploratory vessel met Thrawn's fleet. Having been persuaded by Kinman Doriana, Thrawn opened fire on outbound flight, crippling the vessel. It was only thanks to Lorena Jinsler that outbound flight barely escaped before crashing on an uncharted planetoid nearby. Doriana was then allowed to return to the Republic with the news of outbound flight's destruction. It would take nearly 50 years for the galaxy to learn the true fate of Outbound Flight, when Jedi Masters Luke and Mara Jade Skywalker would journey into the Unknown Regions to locate the remains of the lost ship. But that's another story. For the full story of today's legend, read Outbound Flight and Survivor's Quest by Timothy Zahn. If you want more Legends content, click the thumbs up or subscribe buttons, or just leave a comment down below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all for the next legend.